Hey folks, this is Jake with Seattle Coffee Gear, and today we're gonna to be doing a crew review of the Jura Z10. Now, this is the newest model of the Z line from Jura. It has a couple of cool new features that we actually find really useful and um, kind of new in the market for super automatics. Most notably, there is a cold coffee function, which means that you can actually basically brew cold brew. Uh, it uses pressure, similar to espresso extraction, but you're getting a cold liquid out. So it's a little different than an iced coffee where you're brewing hot coffee over ice. Instead, it's using the kind of the room temperature, the ambient temperature water and brewing it like that. And it actually makes a really good cold brew like drink. Uh, another thing that it has, like a lot of the other Jura models is the automatic uh, grinding uh, adjustment, but this one is new on the Z10. They call it the PRG, you know, Jura loves their acronyms, and that's the Product Recognizing Grinder. Basically, um, instead of adjusting it manually like some older machines, this machine will adjust it each time you brew a drink automatically. Uh, it's a pretty quick process, you know, you don't even have to touch it, you never have to worry about dilate in. Um, the machine will do it for you if you allow it to. Now this model has 16 drinks that you can choose from and you can make any of those drinks cold as well. So you'll see here on the screen, we have the machine up and ready to go. And in the user interface, you can select this snowflake icon and that's giving you uh, a cold version of whatever drink that you'd like. There's a couple that you can't make cold, like a double shot uh, and things like that. But for the most part, most of the standard drinks can be made either cold or hot. You can make doubles for a lot of the options that you have on here. And then you can also increase the strength to give you more ground coffee per drink. Uh, like all other jurors that use a milk system, this has a siphon system here. We're not gonna be using that today, but it's pretty standard for most of these Jura higher end machines. It's got a nice bean hopper. It's got the newer design water tank. It's kind of the more modern iteration that Jura has taken on the design of their machines and we really like it. So I'm gonna get started. Um, I'm actually gonna brew a cold coffee. So over ice, I like to do it over ice. You don't have to, but then it you know stays colder and gets colder. And we're just gonna hit the button. And you can adjust the strength as it's brewing, if you wish. You can also adjust the volume using the knob or the screen. And when you're brewing these colder drinks, you'll actually hear the pump is working a little less hard than with the hot drinks. It kind of pulses, and then you're getting a little bit of extraction, and it pulses again, same. It's just the, the way that Dura has designed this, um, and it tends to take about, you know, a little longer than a shot, maybe about a minute total time, depending on your volume. And all right, so the extraction is finishing up. I'll even put my finger here under the spout. I know that's kind of gross, sorry. Just to show you that it's not hot water at all. It's, it's room temperature. And because it's over ice, you're getting a little bit of, uh, you know, diffusion, I guess. So it's good to stir this. And let's give it a try. So this is just the coffee function, standard parameters that we had with the machine using crew brew. So let's see how it is. And it does, it is, it is similar to a cold brew. It's a, you know how you have that, there's that little different flavor profile that you get on cold brew versus iced coffee. And you are getting more of that in here. I'd say it's somewhere in between because you're 
quickly brewing cold brew. Um, but it's a similar concept to how some there's some commercial cold brewing machines that are out there that um, can brew cold brew in a, in a few minutes as well. And it's pretty innovative for a home super auto machine and it tastes really good. And it's great for, you know, those summer months when the it's getting a little bit warmer outside and you don't necessarily want to make just iced coffee. So I'll show you the rest of the machine here. If you want to adjust or change any of these drinks, just the default parameters for these drinks, you press and hold for uh, about two seconds, two to three seconds. And then you get all these nice features here. Um, so you can adjust the settings and there's a lot of settings, especially for the milk drink. So you're really gonna be able to dial in the options that you want. So for a milk drink, you can set the grind, which kind of overrides that automatic grinder that we were talking about. Coffee strength, the amount of milk, the amount of coffee, the amount of foam, uh, the how long you want it to brew. Uh, how much the total volume is, and then temperature of both milk, the milk foam, and the coffee temperature, just the overall temperature of the drink. Uh, the milk foam temperature is always nice, on the, especially on these nicer, kind of more high-end super autos, having the ability to adjust the milk foam temperature and the milk temperature uh, is great. There's no actual degrees here, it's just levels. So set it to what you like. You can rename your drink so that you know you can name it after your, you, your dog, whoever you want to, um, just whatever your favorite name is for that product. Um, you can set it to pre-select this drink. That's the, when you go here, uh, you can set it to be the first drink that you want to have available. And then you can replace the product and you have all these uh, drink options to choose from. You know, a lot of them are very similar, but you know, if you have a drink that you really enjoy, um, you're going to have plenty of options here with this Jura to adjust your drink. Cool. I have a... And so, yeah, we really like the functions on this machine. The cold coffee function is a really great way to get, you know, uh, during those warmer summer months to get some nice iced drinks. Uh, and you get all the options and the great features that you get with other Jura machines, but this one's just a step above with that cool new uh, cold coffee function and the new automatic grinder. So thank you so much for watching and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.